Those who have grown up during times of war understand that there is no clear beginning. No one remembers how it started. That one spark that started the chaos and destruction. War makes you scared, makes you run for cover, changes people. War makes you want to find a safe place. I remember the calm, the happy times, togetherness tenderness. Those are my early memories. The times when we went outside doing normal family things. Daylight hours were calm and happy. I dreaded the darkness, the silent dinners, the angry stares, the fear in the room. I don't really remember when it started. We heard about the bombings on television and later on the radio. When the electricity went out, we knew it was getting closer. And though somewhere outside, a war was raging, getting closer and closer, the war inside had been going on for years. Our goal was to pretend like everything was normal, that nothing had changed. But my fear of both the inside and the outside is what made me seek the shelter of my new universe. My creation, my quiet, my escape from fighting and noise and hatred and hurt. Frantic knock at the door and unexpected guests. A friend? An enemy? Did we know the difference anymore? Suddenly, she was there. Hannah, the one friend I had. We had rarely seen them since it had started. You thirsty? Camille, can we please get Carolyn something to drink? Sure. I saw the fear in her eyes. Hannah had experienced the war outside. I knew the time had come to share the safety, security, and magic that I had created. Are you scared, Hannah? Uh huh. Me too. Come on, I need to show you something. Watch this. What is this? This is a safe place. Whenever I feel sad or scared, I come here and look at all the stars and I feel safe. You, you see that planet with the big rings around it? Well, that is my planet. It's called William's World. It's the most wonderful place you could ever imagine. Nothing ever goes wrong. Nobody goes there unless I say so. And you could be whatever you wanted to be. This place is really, really special to me. But if you promise to be extra careful, you can have it too. You see how some of the stars make pattern? Well, that one right there is the big Fry and Dipper. <laughs> and the one next to it is his little brother, the little Fry and Dipper. And that one with three in a row is the O'Brien's belt. I don't know what O'Brien is, but I think his pants are falling down. <laughs> <laughs> Hannah? Yeah? Are you okay? I think so. It's okay. I'm here. Is there fighting on every planet and in every galaxy? Does it always end in war? Bombs? Destruction? Pain? Darkness? Our world was in jeopardy. Is this the beginning or the end? Suddenly, thrust into the outside. Fear had finally overtaken me.
Are you scared? Yeah. Here. But then I was reminded. There was a place of calmness, no longer just mine. It was ours. A place of our own. A safe place. Mm -hmm.